United States as a foreign minister of Nepal. And it happens in a context of growing high-level engagement between our two countries. This afternoon, I had a very productive meeting with Secretary of State, the Honorable Anthony Blinken. We took stock of the current state of our relation and exchange view on additional measures to enhance our relationship even further. Both sides took pride in the fact that our two countries share common values of democracy, human rights and freedom. Nepal and the states have enjoyed over 76 years of strong friendship. The United States was the second country with which Nepal established its diplomatic relations. That fact in itself speaks volume of the importance we give our relationship with the United States. It is not only the history but also the substance of friendship which is rich and multifaceted. The U.S. is our valued development partner. Over the past decades, it has played a significant role in the eradication of malaria in our country, as well as in development of human resources and economic growth. I am happy to see the scale of cooperation growing significantly over the years. In time of difficulties, the government, of the government and people of United States have stood in solidarity with the Nepali people. From thousands of miles away, we received plain loads of urgent medical supplies and vaccines during the COVID-19 pandemic, where people were uncertain what the next day would bring to their lives. And, United, and the United States was also one of the first countries to come to the aid of Nepal after the devastating earthquake in 2015. Strong people, strong people to people contact has been a key component to our, of our relationship. The 4,000 plus Peace Corps volunteers who served in Nepal are important linkages between our two peoples. Nepal is also one of the favorite destinations of American tourists and we want to see the number grow in coming years. Similarly, the Nepali diaspora in the U.S has not only contributed to economy and cultural diversity of United States, but also has served as a bridge between the two societies. Nepal is keen to see the talent and skill of Nepali American community in United States channeled systematically for the development of Nepal. During the next few days, my engagement with our American friends will remain focused on reinforcing the solid foundation of these relations and finding ways to expand our friendship even further. With these words, let me again thank Ambassador Khatri for hosting this reception. I thank you all for joining us today. Thank you.